Hi guys, it's Holly from Vape Mill today. I'm unboxing the Hugs Vape Lotus RTA for next week's review. I was asked to review this because apparently it's a bit overlooked and it gives amazing flavour. And I hope it does because I'm quite looking forward to reviewing something that tastes good for once rather than all these things that people say taste good and it never does. Oh, I like it. Holly likes it a lot. Matt Black, super personality. The deck looks quite nice. I was looking at this over there on the line. I'm not quite sure what it looks like. But it looks like some. It looks quite easy to build on too, especially with the wicking holes. The uh, top feels a bit tight. Maybe there was a maybe there was a hack to it. Uh oh, that's naughty. That's very naughty. It comes with a bubble glass. Open it up. Gel. Spare rings. Drip tip adapter, but no extra drip tip, tight get. Screwdriver and spare screws. Rather standard. I do like the drip tip adapter though, it's that extra mile. Extra bit of foam to keep your manual in. Bit of waste of my time. Use a manual, one side print, nice and long. Looks all pretty simple, top cap, airflow. Oh, it lifts. So that means there must be a button. Pulse. Refill. Push the top cap to open. Ah, it just pops open. That looks quite nice too. Ah, so it slides back and pops open. It doesn't feel all that smooth. It feels a bit... Stiff, maybe it'll loosen up, I'm not sure. It feels like it could break quite easily. Anyway, that'll do for today, guys. And check out next on when uh, Friday for the wicking tutorial, and then check out on Tuesday for the review and the giveaway. Thanks for watching, guys. Stay cloudy.